Hey everyone, happy 4th of December. I mean, you could be watching this anytime in the future, but happy whatever day it is in the future. I'm Melanie and I do provide some videos from Snow Business Halls, Trying Things on Town for the first time, experience videos, story times, concert type videos, food hauls, beauty box unboxings, vlogs, and so much more. None of my videos are edited at the moment, and I keep saying it only because you might not have watched any of my other videos, but I'm not going to go into it further. So we are on day four of the Max and Spencer's advent calendar. I'm opening it in the morning. Yesterday it was, I think it was just after lunch when I opened it yesterday, or just after 12. But we're on to day four, and on this it says, Mood, Bright and Beautiful. I mean, what kind of product would that be? I don't even know. I can't even think, I'm too tired, I've not had enough sleep. Why can't I find the opening? I'm trying to oh, You should see the position I'm actually in, it's really uncomfortable trying to open this in front of you. Oh, we have a Murad product. This is oh God, it's a real good brand, it's not a full size. This is the Essential C Day Moisture Broad Spectrum SPF 30 PA. Plus, plus, plus. Um, Reveal radiance and protect skin from UV damage with this vitamin C rich SPF moisturiser, potent antioxidant, ginkgo biloba, leaf extract helps shield skin from environmental aggressors such as pollution for a glowing healthy looking complexion. Apply, apply liberally to face, neck and chest. I mean this isn't going to last long because it's 23 millilitres. I, think I did get a Murad cream in a beauty box a couple of months ago. And I think it was meant to be worth £80. It was a full size. I think it was bigger than 50 mil. I think it's like 60 or 70 mil. And it's, it wasn't hydrating enough for me. I stopped using it after about a third way through because I was having to put other stuff with it. But I actually need to finish it off. I was thinking about it the other day when I saw it in the cupboard that I have in my bathroom. And I was like, I'm going to have to use that up because it's an expensive product. I only bought that box that it came in to purely get that. Yes, it's not hydrating enough, and yes, my skin's drier because of the cold and then the warm and then the cold and then the warm. But I'm just going to have to layer it up with lots of other stuff because I need to use it. So I don't know if this is going to be any better, but I feel like I will be putting a Murad moisturiser on today, whether it's this one or the one that I got in that beauty box. I can't remember the name of it. It came in a big tub. Um... But I was looking forward to getting it, and like I said, it wasn't hydrating enough. Like, um, but I do love vitamin C products. So part of me wants to put this on today, but part of me thinks I should put that other one on, and maybe do a double layer of it and put a lot of serums on just to make sure it's hydrating enough. But I am really happy with this, and I am actually going to take it upstairs with me. Um, you basically know if I like a product if I start using it straight away. Although I didn't take the hair care one upstairs. And I don't know why. I'm not going to be washing my hair till tomorrow. Um, I would normally do it today. But um, I'm doing it tomorrow. There is a reason why. But because this is going up in real time. I'm not going to say. Um, but I've got to go an extra day with my hair. Good job it's cold and rainy and I can wear a hat. But yeah that's day four. If you want to see what's in day five. Which I'm intrigued by. Where is day five? Oh it's here. It's not a big one. Might be a mascara. Can you imagine if I'm right? But anyway, have a great day and come back tomorrow. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed. Press the notification button. And thank you for watching, everyone.